Hello everyone, it is the first uh, weekend of Advent, and so we're gonna do it um, according to COVID procedures this year. We'll do, be doing it in our home, so Mel and I have the privilege of doing our first uh, Sunday Advent, and we'll focus on the theme of hope today. So we'll light the first candle, the candle for hope. And as we've done in years past, we'll read um, passage from the Old Testament regarding hope and passage from the New Testament and uh, begin this countdown towards the season that we remember Christ's first coming. So Psalm 130 is the first passage for hope. Out of the depths I cry to you, Lord. Lord, hear my voice. Let your ears be attentive to my cry for mercy. If you, Lord, kept a record of sins, Lord, who could stand? But with you there is forgiveness so that we can, with reverence, serve you. I wait for the Lord, my whole being waits, and in his word I put my hope. I wait for the Lord more than watchmen wait for the morning, more than watchmen wait for the morning. Israel, put your hope in the Lord. For with the Lord is unfailing love, and with him is full redemption. He himself will redeem Israel from all their sins. And from 1 Peter chapter 1, verses 3 to 9. Blessed be the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ. According to his great mercy, he has caused us to be born again to a living hope through the resurrection of Jesus Christ from the dead, to an inheritance that is imperishable, undefiled, and unfading, kept in heaven for you, who by God's power are being guarded through faith for a salvation ready to be re revealed in the last time. In this you rejoice, though now for a little while, if necessary, you have been grieved by various trials, so that the tested genuineness of your faith, more precious than gold that perishes though it is tested by fire, may be found to result in praise and glory and honor at the revelation of Jesus Christ. Though you have not seen him, you love him. Though you do not now see him, you believe in him and rejoice with joy, that is inexpressible and filled with glory, obtaining the outcome of your faith, the salvation of your souls. So I wish you um, a hope-filled season as we look forward to uh, the coming of Christmas. And uh, the Advent wreath and candle will pass around to three other households in the uh, three weekends that are coming. So uh, look for these on, in our video playlist each week. Uh, God bless.